This little girl innocently followed her cats to the family barn and was shocked when she saw the huge secret her parents were hiding inside. What she did next surprised everyone. On a special Christmas morning, a five-year-old Annie Klepper woke up with a sense of magic in the air. She couldn't contain her excitement as she opened her eyes, ready to embrace the day. In her pink pajamas, she yawned and stretched, wearing a smile at the prospect of discovering what Santa had left for her under the tree. Just like any typical five-year-old, she was eager to find the surprises waiting for her. In a burst of excitement, Annie rushed to the living room, where a sight of festive magic awaited. Colorfully wrapped boxes adorned the space beneath the twinkling Christmas tree. The temptation was too much for her to resist, and, with eager hands, she tore into the presents. To her delight, she discovered construction papers, regular papers, and special markers neatly tucked within the boxes. Santa had remembered her artistic inclinations. Unable to contain her excitement, Annie gathered her newfound treasures and hurried to find her parents. Weirdly enough, they were nowhere to be found inside the house. Annie remembered that they had helped her open her presents the year before and couldn't believe they had missed this exciting moment this time around. But she wasn't upset. In fact, this would be the perfect occasion for her to show them her new papers and markers herself. She just needed to find them, and if they weren't inside the house, they must be in their backyard. Annie slipped into her boots, ready to explore the winter wonderland outside. The Christmas decorations glistened in the morning light, transforming the surroundings into a festive spectacle. As she stepped out, she immediately encountered her mom, who greeted her with open arms. The warmth of the embrace was soothing, and in the chilly air, her mom draped a green coat around her shoulders, ensuring she stayed cozy during her outdoor escapade. Excitement bubbled within Annie as she turned to her mom, proudly displaying the artistic gifts from Santa. Look what Santa brought me, she exclaimed, waving the construction papers, regular papers, and the special marker. Her mom couldn't contain a huge smile. Isn't this the best Christmas ever? She asked with a wink. Annie interpreted it as a rhetorical question and continued frolicking in the snow. Her giggles resonated through the backyard as she ran back and forth, looking around for details that could trigger her artistic instincts. Amidst the winter play, the family cat joined Annie in a peculiar way. As she affectionately cuddled and petted it, something unexpected happened. All of a sudden, the cat meowed loudly and made its way towards the family's animal barn. Intrigued by its behavior, Annie sensed an enigmatic calling, a silent urge to follow it. Little did she realize that her cheerful morning held a surprising turn of events, leading to a secret adventure waiting for her in the barn. Annie followed behind the cat, her excitement undiminished. The cat gracefully slipped through the barn's small opening, leaving Annie faced with a challenge. Unlike her feline companion, the five-year-old struggled to fit through the narrow gap. Determined to uncover the mystery within, she attempted to part the barn doors open, but her efforts were thwarted by a lack of strength. It seemed the barn held secrets that required more than just enthusiasm to unveil. Annie's mom happened to be there just at the right moment, capturing those special memories with her camera. When she saw that Annie needed help unveiling the surprise hidden in the barn, she jumped in alongside her to push the doors open. Inside, the barn was illuminated with gentle light, creating a warm atmosphere. The cat was sniffing at something hidden behind the wooden fence of an enclosure, and the little girl giggled at its curiosity. As she stepped into the barn, Annie was greeted not only by her mother's encouraging smile, but also by the sight of her father, holding a camera and filming her every move. Her parents were ready to capture the magic about to unfold as they exchanged a knowing glance, their cameras capturing the moment. Annie dashed towards her dad, completely clueless about the surprise in store for her. With pure joy, she excitedly recounted the story of Santa's presence, neatly placed under the Christmas tree. Her words brimmed with delight and contentment, just like any child soaking in the magic of the festive season. Her father was delighted to see his daughter so happy about some paper and markers. He had never wanted Annie to grow up as a spoiled or ungrateful child and was happy to know that she would have been ecstatic if that was all Santa had brought her. However, that definitely wasn't the case. 
turning around in the barn, Annie noticed a subtle change that had escaped her initial excitement. A large red bow hung decoratively on the door of one of the enclosures, catching her eye. Her innocent assumption led her to believe that Santa, in his generosity, had not only left gifts for her, but had also considered the horses in the barn. With gentle admiration, she approached the enclosure, marveling at the festive touch added by the red piece of fabric. Eager to share her discovery, Annie called out to her mom, Look, Santa dropped a bow for the horses too. Her mom, intrigued by her daughter's observation, replied with a thoughtful, You think so? Undeterred, Annie was quick to explain that Santa had indeed left treats for the horses. Beneath the decorative bow lay a basket filled with various equine-centric accessories, and she pointed excitedly for her mom to see. A cute smile adorned Annie's face as she innocently hypothesized that the basket of equine items might be intended for her. Squatting down, she peered into the basket, examining its contents. Her small hands carefully picked up a pink horse brush and a book about horses. The discovery elicited a sense of wonder and joy as she wondered how generous Santa must have been to drop gifts for the animals in the barn. Amidst the equine-themed items, Annie unearthed a scroll nestled in the basket. With curiosity piqued, she eagerly opened it and began reading aloud the words inscribed on the parchment. Since she was just five years old, she stumbled through some words but pressed on. The scroll turned out to be a heartfelt message from Santa, expressing love and hope for her happiness with the gifts. However, it hinted at something more, a special gift yet to be revealed. In the midst of reading, Annie encountered a word she couldn't pronounce. Her mom, attentive and supportive, stepped in to assist. Annie had initially mistaken ponies for presents, but with her mom's guidance, she corrected herself. As she pronounced the correct word, her imagination ran wild. The notion of receiving a pony from Santa seemed to materialize in her mind. The large bow on the wall, the equine-themed items in the basket, all pointed to the possibility of a second, extraordinary gift. In her young mind, she pondered, Did Santa gift me a pony? In her excitement and curiosity, she decided to stop reading and explore the barn carefully with her eyes, her senses heightened by the anticipation of an extraordinary surprise. As Annie curiously scanned the barn for a hidden surprise, her mom helped her complete reading the letter from Santa. The last sentence hinted at a surprise closer to her than she imagined. When the pieces of the puzzle finally locked into place, the little girl turned towards the enclosure once again, and, at that very moment, a soft nay came from the other side of the doors. Annie's doubt about a surprise pony gift immediately vanished when her mom disclosed his middle name is Snowflake, so his full name is Pepper Snowflake Klepper. The revelation confirmed Annie's suspicions, and she couldn't contain her joy. I got my pony, she screamed with glee, revealing a heartwarming smile. She reached for the door handle, but was too short to grab it. Overpowering her mom's voice, she excitedly asked, Mommy, would you open the doors? The room buzzed with the infectious energy of a five-year-old on the brink of a delightful surprise. Basking in the joy of her daughter's excitement, her mom obliged Annie's request. With a slow and deliberate motion, she opened the enclosure, unveiling the surprise that awaited. Annie's eyes widened with pure delight as a gentle and lovely gray pony stood before her. The pony, seemingly as happy as its new owner, exuded warmth and affection. Annie wasted no time, happily walking towards the little horse in reaching out to nuzzle the adorable creature. Capturing the entire heartwarming scene on camera, Annie's parents couldn't help but get emotional. Tears of happiness streamed down their faces as they witnessed the pure and unfiltered joy radiating from their daughter. The recorded moments of Annie's happiness became a treasure that her parents wished to share with the world. In the aftermath of the emotional reveal, Annie's parents decided not to keep the heartwarming videos to themselves. They posted the recordings on social media, letting the world witness the genuine happiness and surprise that unfolded in their barn that Christmas morning. It was December 2010, a season of festivity, love, and kindness. The videos of Annie's joyous encounter with her new pony quickly went viral on YouTube, 
touching the hearts of millions around the globe. In sharing their precious moments, Annie inadvertently became a YouTube sensation, spreading the magic of Christmas to people far and wide. Little did Annie or her parents know that this Christmas would be more than just a cherished memory. The unexpected twist of receiving a pony set in motion a series of events that would forever shape Annie's life, propelling her into a world where her love for horses would become a source of inspiration for many. After the joyous Christmas morning when Pepper the Pony became Annie's cherished gift, she devoted herself wholeheartedly to building deep bonds with her newfound equine companion. The delight in Annie's eyes was mirrored by Pepper's fondness for her presence, especially when she approached him with the treats that the pony eagerly enjoyed. And when Pepper allowed the little girl to climb on his back for the first time, her cheerful giggles were heard for miles. As time passed, Annie's interest in horse riding blossomed. Guided by her father, she spent months learning the ropes of riding her pony. These moments became the foundation for Annie's budding passion for equestrian pursuits. The unlimited time spent with her pony best friend not only strengthened their bond, but also nurtured her riding skills. Of course, Annie's journey into horse riding wasn't without its challenges. There were moments when she would temporarily lose control of her spirited pony during rides or playful activities around the barn. She never hurt herself too badly, but the falls were always scary for this tiny little girl. However, these setbacks failed to deter her. Fearlessly, she would mount her pony again, determined to conquer any obstacles that came their way. Recognizing her genuine love for equestrian pursuits, her parents made the decision to enroll her as a kid dressage rider. The decision marked a pivotal moment in Annie's journey, opening the doors to formal training and structured learning in the world of dressage. Three years after the magical Christmas gift of a pony, eight-year-old Annie had already immersed herself passionately in the world of horses. Her love for these majestic creatures had transformed her into a skilled young dressage rider, an accomplishment that defied her young age. Annie's dedication and natural talent set her apart from others her age, making her journey into the equestrian world remarkable. As a skilled rider, Annie found herself drawn not only to the act of riding itself, but also to the desire to make her mark on the sport. One day, a spark of inspiration ignited within her during a dressage riding session. Initially dismissing it as one of those fleeting thoughts that often cross a child's mind, Annie soon realized that this idea was different. It was a game changer. Annie's revelation came in the form of a realization that there was a significant gap in the market when it came to kids' apparel for young dressage riders. The existing apparel was not functional enough and lacked the vibrancy and fun that could make the sport more appealing to children. Little did Annie know that this seemingly simple idea would evolve into a potential game changer for the world of dressage riding. Eager to share her innovative idea, Annie approached her mother Shannon during a dressage riding session. Rather than dismissing it as a trivial thought, Shannon was genuinely impressed by Annie's creativity and ability to spot an opportunity for positive change in the sport. She praised Annie for her keen observation and encouraged her to explore this unique avenue. The recognition from Shannon fueled Annie's determination to bring her ideas to fruition. The existing options were simply too plain, and there was no way any child would ever choose them if something new entered the market. Recognizing an opportunity to bring innovation to the field, they embarked on a journey to fill this void. Out of this shared vision, Annie's equestrian apparel was born, marking a significant milestone in Annie's journey from a passionate horse rider to a budding entrepreneur in the world of equestrian sports. When asked about the inspiration behind Annie's equestrian apparel, Annie herself would proudly declare, every time we do a new collection, we try to make something completely different from what we've seen in the horse world. At just eight years old, Annie was already changing the world in her own way, one item of clothing at a time. Her commitment to crafting designs that were both unique and elegant, with a touch of fun, set her brand apart making it a go-to for young riders seeking something beyond the ordinary. But her apparel line was not her only success in the world of horse riding. 
Annie's unwavering passion for all things equestrian propelled her to remarkable heights, achieving the title of North American champion by the tender age of 15. The journey that began with the snowy Christmas morning encounter with Pepper, her beloved pony, evolved into a remarkable story of triumph and success. When Annie met Pepper on that magical Christmas morning in 2010, the thought of becoming the youngest dressage rider in history to win double gold in the FEI North American Youth Championships never crossed anyone's mind. However, fast forward to July 2019, and Annie had not only realized that dream, but had surpassed it, riding Happy Texas Moonlight, a 13-year-old Oldenburg gelding known as Lewis, Annie secured first place in both the individual test and the freestyle test. This extraordinary feat, achieved in only their second competition together, contributed to the U.S. winning a team silver medal, an accomplishment that had never even entered Annie's mind during the early days of her equestrian journey. At that time, she thought she would never love another horse as much as her pony Pepper. But Annie's journey took an unexpected turn when she embarked on the search for the perfect horse to participate in competition. The relationship between Annie and Lewis began by accident during a trip to Germany. Originally there to explore a different horse, Annie and her family were introduced to Lewis, a gallant horse, to which Annie now refers to as the best horse in the world. At 18 HH, Lewis posed a unique challenge for Annie, who had spent the previous five years showing ponies. Uncertain about the match, she decided to give it a try anyway. Climbing onto the back of the super big Lewis, Annie was initially taken aback. However, the connection was immediate. Annie recalls, I got on and I was like, oh my gosh, this is the horse. I knew immediately that he was the one. It's funny how these things work out. We have a really, really solid relationship and I'm thankful for that. With her deep connection and unwavering passion for equines, Annie proved that her journey was far from over. She was soon nicknamed Dressage Superstar by day, designer by night, attesting to her dual success as both a skilled dressage rider and a thriving equine sport apparel designer. With her popular brand, Anne's Equestrian Apparel, she became an entrepreneurial equestrienne, making significant contributions to both the sports and fashion realms of the equestrian world. Despite being a dressage superstar and successful entrepreneur, Annie felt that she had much more to offer the world of equines. However, an unforeseen event turned her world upside down, the 2020 COVID-19 pandemic. This challenging time tested Annie's resilience as she found herself confined indoors during a period when she loved nothing more than being outside with her horses, doing what she loved best. During the lockdown, with her dreams of becoming one of the top U.S. dressage riders temporarily put on hold. As Annie had grown up, so had her brand, expanding to include adult clothes such as snazzy schooling breeches and show jackets. The success of her business had solidified her standing as a designer and also provided financial support for her riding endeavors. As her dressage career soared, so did the associated costs and her entrepreneurial spirit became a lifeline for maintaining her presence in the competitive equestrian arena. Amidst the worldwide slowdown caused by the COVID-19 pandemic, Annie decided to take a thoughtful trip down memory lane to where her journey all began. She would have never become a rider or an entrepreneur if she hadn't found a sweet pony in her barn that Christmas morning. And for that amazing gift from Santa, she would be forever grateful. Have you once been in Annie's shoes? Tell us in the comment section how a pet animal has helped you find a new sense of purpose. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.